Kia ora everybody, my name is Dinya from the Open Table Tennis Association and welcome to day 8 of the 30 day stay home table tennis challenge. If you haven't seen yesterday's video, please do watch it before coming back and trying today's challenge. During tips 1 and 2 from yesterday's challenge video, we learned the correct ready positioning and sidestep footwork. Now, learning and revisiting these skills will be beneficial to your progress throughout this challenge series and especially important if you want to complete today's challenge successfully. So, what is today's challenge? Before we get into today's challenge, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and click the bell icon to turn your notifications on so that you know when we post a new video. Also, check us out on Instagram at AucklandTTOfficial for more table tennis fun. The challenge for today is called Volley King. The rules are simple, but carrying it out can be a bit tricky. We need to try and hit the ball onto the wall and back onto our racket five times, but it needs to be done on the full. So the ball must not hit any other object in between the rallies. And if the ball hits the floor, we need to start again. It should look something like this. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Aside from standing in the correct ready position and knowing how to sidestep, here are a couple more tips that can help you complete today's challenge successfully. It is important to position yourself at a distance away from the wall where you feel comfortable to hit the ball over and over again to keep the rally going. Now, if we stand too far away from the wall, we'll have to hit the ball quite hard for it to come back to us. On the other hand, if we stand too close to the wall, the ball may come to us at a speed which we are not ready for. Let me show you a technique you can use to find the correct distance you should stand from the wall. The technique I use to distance myself from the wall correctly is called the big step technique. Start with your back against the wall, then take one big step forward. Spin around to face the wall. This is where you should be standing before you start the Volley King challenge. Once you've found the best distance to stand from the wall, the second tip is simply to try and use your backhand to control the bounces against the wall. This should make it easier for you. And remember, make sure your elbow is slightly away from your body while trying the challenge. Some of you may be using your wrist to hit the ball. This causes the ball to go off on an angle. To make sure this isn't you, lock your wrist in the straight positioning and then play from your elbow using your forearm to gently tap the ball forward. This last tip will help you play more rallies against the wall. Instead of hitting the ball hard, try to hit it with an underarm motion and contact the ball upward onto the wall. After the ball hits the wall, gravity will begin to bring the ball back down with speed. Use the speed along with the gentle contact with your forearm to continue the rallies. If you're finding this challenge easy, try to complete the challenge while walking toward the wall. See how close you can get to the wall without losing control of the ball. It should look something like this. Okay, so I'm going to start by my couch and make my way towards the wall. Just to wrap things up, I'm going to show you what a successful challenge for day 8 looks like. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 
Don't have a bat or a ball? No problem. Give these challenges a go using common household items like a frying pan and a tennis ball. Let me show you. No problem. One, two, three, four, five. Remember to video yourself trying today's challenge. Use the hashtags Auckland Table Tennis and Stay Home Table Tennis and tag us at Auckland TT Official so we can accurately record your entries to go in the draw to win the free one year stadium membership at the Auckland Table Tennis Association. If you would like more information, please visit our website at www.tabletennis.net.nz or click on the link in the description below to find out more about the Auckland Table Tennis Association and the services that we offer. Thank you all very much for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed today's challenge. If you did enjoy this video, please do share it with your friends. Also, hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more daily videos. Stay safe, be kind, and I will see you all tomorrow for the next video.